Hello and welcome to SteamCon 2017 and we are here today for the Guild Ball British Championship Qualifiers for 2018. Yeah. The winner of this event gets a free ticket and a hotel room on the weekend of the British Champs. So, I'm Jamie. I'm, I'm joined, JJ. Joined by JJ again yeah. and the Goomba. And the Go I mean, the Goomba hat, I feel like it's now a valuable part of the stream. It is. Like, we've, we've, we've lost James. We've replaced, Gaming, him. we've replaced him with a Goomba. I mean, I'm not sure how James is going to feel about that. I don't know. We'll see. I don't know how the Goomba feels about that. <laughs> All right, so for you guys on the stream, we have got Fraser McFetridge with the Masons Guild, and we have got Florian Town with the Alchemist Guild. Round one, like sort of a... Pretty good bit, matchup. Bit of a giant killing in round one. Well, not a giant killing, both giants killing each other. Yeah, yeah. So big matchup in round one. And Fraser McFetridge, famed for his Masons Guild, doing very well. Honor, right? Doing very well on the Scottish scene, especially with honour. And his roster of 10 is Honor, Hammer, Marbles, Brick, Harmony, Veteran Harmony, who I think we might see come out this game, Tower, Flint, Mallet, and Decimate. Yep. And Florian Tam has Smoke, my favorite captain. Yeah. Midas, Naja, Mist, Calculus, Vitriol, Venin, Mercury, Compound, and Veteran Catalyst. Yeah. I mean, I think we're probably going to see Honor and Smoke here. Um, I... I they, they, that would be my expectation. Exactly. Smoke seems good into Masons. Yeah. I mean, Midas is still good into Masons, but oh yeah. But, but I think, Smoke uh, seems to suit the play a, bit, a little bit better. Exactly. So I think we'll see. I think we'll see Smoke come down with Naja, yeah. obviously, and then a bit of a, a long bomb game using that yeah. using that Just um, the inspiration to generate momentum. Yeah. And then maybe like a, a vet cat that's being held back to essentially the, like punish anyone that overcommits. The, uh, overcommits. Flint, when he comes in for the goal, if he doesn't have knee slider, has to just dodge a little bit, gets killed by V-Cat, gets four VPs to two, yep. get that again, exactly. control the ball on uh, smoke, and then you go, oh, well, cloud jumper, goal. Exactly. It's the uh, risk that you run if you aren't overcommit, like, if, if you don't get deep into them. Yeah. And the exactly. thing is, like, uh, I, if you're playing that, I expect to see compound. Yep. Uh, that's the team that I would, not, I would choose to run against this. And you've just got to take that compound charge and try and bait him out. Yep. If you can get him away from the goal and lose that protection bubble, the Masons are, are laughing. Exactly, that's it. So I think, I mean, Fraser's known for running honor. Yeah. Not a big Hammer fan. Um, Hammer could be the right call into this one. It could, it could be, but so I, he's stoic, I so he doesn't really care about that counter charge too much. Exactly. From compound, if he's chosen, and he can, he can, he's got the movement benefits. Yeah. To no, ignore precisely. that fire that's definitely going to be put on him. I think we might not see the brick marbles bubble here, um, or maybe it's, maybe not, it's not. It's does. It's not as relevant. It's not as relevant. Just ignores the whole thing. Yeah. Uh, moves through it. Vet Harmony, I think, is probably coming down. Smelling salts, Smelling obviously, salts. super useful in this scenario. So 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 key. Um, but I think the the other thing that Fraser, I mean, Fraser is going to be aware of this anyway, but yeah. probably needs to bring in someone like Mallet to make sure yeah. he's got someone that can get to smoke. Yes. Should he just go and try and kill the ball and just start lobbing things? Yeah. Uh, no, no, I completely agree with that one. Although an on-fire mallet is not a happy mallet. No, no, exactly. There's I mean, that is a huge risk, but I think having that's Vet Harmony need. there... If, if, if chosen, Vet Harmony just smelling salts to keep everyone clumped up. Yeah, everyone gets, everyone gets poisoned, everyone gets set on fire, everyone clears it. Exactly. Vet Harmony last, held deep. Yeah. Keep her just, safe. Just two on her every single turn. Yep. It is still two, isn't it, for smelling salts? I'm not mistaken that one. I believe so. Yes, yeah, still two. So we can uh, we can see Florian's got smoke on top of the uh, pile of cards behind his. Yeah. I think he may have already chosen. Well, Naja and uh, Marbles have gone out, definitely. Yep. As they're the only choices, and I believe that they've either. I think they're waiting on us to go and give them the thumbs up for roster selection. So. Okay. They've dealt their plot cards, and I guess they're going to just wait for wait for us to give them the thumbs up. Runner's gone now to uh, sort that out. But again, like both of these guys, really great players. Yep. Normally, normally, sort of at the top end of things. Yeah, Fraser obviously winning Irish Nationals, going to yes. Worlds uh, next week. Oh, well, the week after, sorry. And yeah. uh, Florian, you know, always, always a threat. Um, yeah. I think we've uh, hammers gone out for the Masons. Yep. And and, and smoke. smoke as predicted there. All right, let's sort out their plot cards now. It's uh, interesting to see Fraser playing Hammer. Yeah. Uh, like I say, he doesn't normally. So maybe he's, um, you know, finally picking up on what the Germans have been telling him for a while. Yeah. We can see, sneakily, what, what um, 
Florian might pick. So definitely going to choose heroic landing. I mean, you must think so, right? Man marking and composure. Man marking not fantastic into hammer with no. this team. Puts no, heroic landing in the bin. Well, he doesn't have too many heroic players, does he? Uh, I guess he, he doesn't want to go with that cat then. You must. He, you, you've got to think so. Um, which is an interesting choice. I would have thought that cat into this would have been okay. Yeah. Maybe he's not going to play as defensive. Yeah. Uh, that was Frazier there, winning the roll off to choose if he kicks or receives. And Frazier to put it down kick. first. One of the key things when playing against Smoke is not giving her the final activation of the turn. Yep. And if he just put down the uh, veteran harmony, then he gets the op opportunity exactly. to clear all the conditions. Mercury coming down there with, with the Smoke team, not unexpected. Ninja fire AoE is probably the most important. That's tower, tower going down. Coming down. Calculus coming down. I mean, we're just yeah. seeing the condition game firing up here already. So the expected duo. Bet harmony. Bet harmony. No surprises. And as Frasier here, I guess you're thinking like, right, so you're going to be clearing this. I need to now have some damage coming from elsewhere. Yeah. If, I, if I'm going to get my two takeouts, two goals. No, it goes for that cat. So that cat. Continues to play that game. I'd want heroic landing if I was had, even had it in my head. That I was Exactly. I, even if there's a possibility. I mean, I know there's no one else in the team that really has a heroic. No. But, I mean, if you've got, you, you've got to know you're taking that cat into if this. It, it decimate, decimate coming down. Interesting choice, I think. Um... Do you, do you think we see Flint at the end of this? I think it's a bit of a risky play. I mean, you've then got no two-inch melee. Oh, and we've got good, compound. Good, good, so I think point. we're going to yeah. see a long gun line here. Yeah. So then oh, he can, at this point in time, he can just kill the ball with smoke and there's nothing, nothing that yeah. Fraser can do about it. And so brick. we see Brick for the counter charge, which obviously then stops stops anything coming too far forward. Yeah. But it, it, simultaneously, it, 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 the other thing that does that, That's the one two-inch melee. Yeah, it's the one two-inch melee. But it means, that, it means that if anyone does come a little bit too far forward, mm. Brick with his counter charge not being tied to the goalpost yep. essentially means he can sit mid-table. And if you slightly overcommit, Hammer can go in. And it means yeah. Vetcat can't then come into Hammer and destroy him. No. So it gives, uh, it gives Hammer a lot of reach yep. uh, and allows that sort of counter punch to protect in yeah. the midfield. It's definitely an interesting one. So we got two two-inch melee, or well, three two-inch melees, including Naja, but... Two two-inch melees versus one two-inch melee. Yeah, and two unpredictable movements, which yeah. is, I think, going to be quite telling in this game. Yeah. Um, if if Fraser's going for those takeouts, you've got to think he's going after Calculus. Um, Mercury Cal Calculus not is surprisingly hard. I mean, I know, I know Hammer can get the work done. Not, yep. not, not, not debating that. But Calculus and Mercury are always, like, tricky to take out because they have 15 health. Yeah. It's and that just that extra one. Makes a big difference. And... Uh, it, not even on the rolls that you make, but just when you say, oh, how much health does she have? 15? It's like, hmm. I, I reliably do eight, and that's just over half. You heal that back. And you're like, eight, yeah. uh, I've, I've not really put that, in, that dent in. And at 4-1 with both of them and taking conditions as you go in. Mm -hmm. it just I think the other interesting thing we might see here is a combination between Decimate and Hammer. So being yeah. able to go in, delete a model, and then get out again with second wind yeah. uh, will be super powerful here for, for Fraser to use. Obviously, then, um, the other great thing with that combination is it brings Hammer back, even if he does overextend, returns him returns to the lines, him. so he can take Punishing yep. Mark and Iron Fist again. Yep, uh, and the start of the next going. turn. And can always bring him back into, if not into complete safety, at least into Brick or Marble's range. Yep, exactly. So I think we'll see a lot of that sort of hit and run targeting Calculus and Mercury, especially. Yep. Uh, there's no real other targets that Fraser has for takeouts here. No. So unless uh, unless Florian doesn't well, really it, I guess heal it, Vet Cat, it, it, it's Vet Cat if he doesn't blow himself up. Yep. And witness me. If, if I, I've had it where I've, I've had I've, I've thought I've had a witness me on the table, gone in, missed the the, the intensifier on the charge or one, one of the intensifier attacks, mm -hmm. and then he sits there as a big two-one model, going, "Oh, yeah, you're going to just farm him, aren't you?" Exactly. No, I mean, the, the standard sort of smoke play that we'll, we'll see, I think, um, well, I think we'll see some pretty standard stuff opening turn here. So yeah. I expect to see a legendary from smoke turn one, get oh, the conditions going. legendary turn two. 
Depends. I mean, look at how clumped up he is there. I think there's a real potential that if Smoke uh, is going last... It, it goes super aggressive, yeah. Go very aggressive. Um, I, think, I, I think you go Legendary turn two, um, mainly because the Mason's going to have final activation. They stay clumped up, they take the conditions, and then and they just, just clear smell it salts clear it all. Yep. So see, see how they commit and then, and then go for the Legendary? And then, I think le Legendary in turn two to then drift them around and get all the conditions back on. And yep. it forces that Veteran Harmony activation... And you, 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 you always want to go with, with last with smoke. Yeah, you, of course, of you, course. You don't want any chance that they can remove yep. those conditions. Yep. But I think it'll, it'll be interesting to see how this goes. I mean, Hammer obviously kicking, um, everyone moving up. Hammer then is a threat to basically go for goal yeah. straight away. Uh, given the deployment, you have to think that the ball will wind up on Naja to stop that from happening. Yeah, I mean... It, or it, smoke. Or smoke. I, I think Naja's your, your best bet there. I mean, Def 5-0 with two-inch melee, unpredictable. Yeah. It only Brick can get can base to baser and yep. stay engaged, and even then, Brick's probably not going to be able to get a tackle on her. No, no, Brick's uh, Brick's not getting a tackle on a 5-0 model. No, <laughs> no. It's momentous though if he manages it. Yeah, what he does with the ball then, he's not yeah. sure. No, just, just eats I don't it. think he's ever had it. He's never made a tackle in his life. So I don't know about you, Jamie, but understanding uh, a couple of very, very different accents is going to be interesting yeah, for yeah. understanding this game. Fraser, yeah. obviously, very Scottish. Yeah. Uh, Florian, very French. Very French. Uh, big, big deltas, big deltas. My yeah. accent not helping. No. Just very confusing. All for confusing for me. Yeah. <laughs> Three different accents, all, all flooding into my ears. Yeah. So we see the kickoff here I mean, with Hammer. No standard. surprises. You think he's going to kick it out wide, get it as far away from Nausea and Smoke as possible. Uh, uh, com meaning that uh, coming from the stream here, look at the amazing bases on Florian's models. The guys all standing on the, the rocks. Yep. Looking really cool there. An inaccurate kick. It's in the six to the all five. Right. So it's gone off. It's essentially. Yep. So Straight to Nausea. Yep. Cool. I'm, I'm, it depends if he wants to go with the... Depends where he wants to go with this. I mean, yeah. he could basically... I think putting it... Yeah, he's put it on a Mercury. It's a great place for it to be, uh, obviously, stopping... You know, if Hammer wants to go in... Yeah. Hammer wants to go in, he's going to put himself on fire to reclaim that ball. And at the end of the day, he can just drop it on Naja from there. It doesn't yeah, even it doesn't need, need the to, momentum. doesn't need to commit it. He might, he, might, he might even just... He's, he's got a great kick of 4-6. He might just pass it to Naja just to get one momentum, yep. give himself the advantage, probably get in three momentum total with momentous inspiration as well. Exactly. Guarantees the choice of going first or second and probably yep. chooses, depending on the board state, maybe go second to get a guarantee final activation. Yeah. The other, the other interesting part there is, I mean, it gives, you, it gives you the option to basically pass it on to Smoke if he's got an E-slider or something like that to go yeah. for the turn one goal, yeah. to then take the uh, early activations yep. to recover Smoke, essentially, yes. and, and go from there. Yeah. So we're seeing straight from the get-go, Mercury moving up, dropping a, dropping a fire blast on Hammer. I mean, anything that limits his movement, pretty yep. good. Pretty good and hitting. Hits. So that's two down to one damage and a momentum generated for the Alchemist team. And did he? Did, did he yeah, he hit him. So he set yep. on fire. And then making a pass to smoke. To smoke. Decimate here, just jogging up. Got to think the second wind is coming. Outside of three of Hammer, making sure that these can't be passed around. Forcing forcing Smoke to essentially use her winds. Yeah. Yep, second wind second going Second wind on Hammer, Hammer, as we expected. Florian is not from France. He is from northern Germany. Apologies to both nations. It's less likely to retreat. Yeah. <laughs> He's that second win to carry on. <laughs> <laughs> Try to blind him. Yep. It's successful. I love blind. Blind, blind is hammer is just brutal. I mean, 
Hammer now being blinded and on fire. On fire. Minus four, minus, minus four. four move. His, ta his kick stat is now essentially one six. Yeah. Uh, right, so we drop and snap onto. Yep. Onto smoke. Onto smoke, and then throwing out the poison AoE. Putting it again on hammer. Start, on start hammer, racking just st up. Stack that up and hits him. Hits so it takes another damage and another momentum generated. So that is three momentum for the Alchemist player. Yep. Hammer not loving life right now. No. I, I, I'm not sure about putting so many conditions on Hammer so quickly um, before, the, before the smoke activation. And yeah. I mean, the, the issue that Fraser's got here is he wants to stay outside of three to obviously limit the number of conditions going down. Yep. But when he does that, he limits the effectiveness of smelling salts. Exactly. So, so he's almost better. Better clumping up clumping and going, up. oh no, everybody's poisoned. Everyone's on fire. Not anymore. Yep. I mean, it, it, oh sure, it puts a bit of extra damage on everyone from the initial impacts. Yeah. But those sorts of things can be easily mitigated. Um, well, once, once they're down, though, yeah. Then you might as well come together because you, 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 they're just going to get breezed onto you anyway. Exactly. And then you just you clear with second with uh, second wind with uh, smelling salts. And what, one of the interesting things is, is that you really want the fire AOE to be hitting all these people. Exactly. I think you duplicate the fire AOE and have it on the charge lane that Hammer wants, so that when he does clear himself with smelling salts, he still has to go through the fire. Yeah, and, that's and then you, you drift the other one probably onto brick because brick on fire is probably the worst thing ever. Yeah, it's. I mean, it really limits him. And that's the thing I think that we'll see. I, th I hope we see Florian do, and I think we see a lot of players um, sort of. I'm, I don't want to say misuse, but use maybe not in the most optimum way is the fire AOE you where put they're it in constantly front. trying to hit. Yeah, you putting it a millimeter in front so they've got no yeah. way around. Either, either you, you go on a huge diversion around it, or you go through it and take that minus two on the on the nose. Exactly. Can't glide through it like with the rough ground. AOEs, you just have to take it. Yep. But Catalyst there just jogs, deteriorates, and uh, Florian there saying, "Please remind." I, I do this when I play with Vet Cat. Please remind me if I forget yep. my four damage because it's a negative rule that I need to remember. And if I forget, I just get a straight up advantage. So you need to remember it as well. Exactly. Just checking the uh, the counter charge on compound to see if he can actually. Get to more than an inch in front of yeah. uh, calculus. There, to I think so, some, her. So, something we saw on uh, compound then was the horrific code would be put up. Right, great turn one ability. You, you stay in rush keeper. You put horrific code up. You say if you want to come in and push the knock back, get this ball. It's going to be difficult for you to take the shot on goal. Yep. Sprint five with hammer. So we see hammer coming to the edge there. He's Did he clear fire or something? No, he said he could sprint five inches. He's, he's blind as well? He's blind as well. So he can only sprint three at that point. Oh, he's taken Punishing March. Taking yes, Punishing yeah. March to go back up to five. Not choosing to use Second Wind. Interesting placement there. So Florian then saying, so Vet Harmony, how does she remove the conditions? And She's got smelling salts. Yep. I mean, I can see what what um, I mean, it's Fraze has done there is because Smoke has to jump into an AOE. Yeah. He's basically forcing it. If if because he if if Fraser's that side of the AOE, Smoke then has to enter the AOE essentially and get poisoned and get poisoned and fire and, and all fire. Yeah. Uh, for the continued roll. Yeah. But the other thing is, is being on the other side would mm. allow her to be that much further up the pitch to take those extra results to get into goal range. Yes, yeah. So what Fraser's done is like, I'm already on fire, I'm already poisoned. I just, I'm just going to deny you some movement here. Yes, yeah. And yeah. momentum generation. No, for sure. But I, I don't think you go for a goal here. I think you just, no. you just. I think going for a goal give, is a bad option. Give, yeah. I think given where things are, I would be pushing these onto Vet Harmony. Because if she's poisoning and burning, she's only got 10 health. Mm -hmm. You know, you, with, with the three damage that comes, your legendary next turn, you could quite happily cloud jump over to her yep. and just kill her. Exactly. And kill her, and then you, the other guys get hit by the, uh, the uh, legendary damage as well. Yep. You get your take out, and you, you maybe get a goal as well. Exactly. 
So we've just seen the, both the AoEs blown onto marbles. Okay. Um, and then passing the ball to, to Mercury. Okay. Now going to throw a smoke bomb. You've got to think that's to teleport back again. Yeah, you just, you just jump back to complete safety. Yep. Um, with full momentum, you probably go first. Not the one I would have done. I'd have duplicated and drifted the fire around a little bit more. Yeah, I think I think getting Decimate on fire early would have been very useful. Yeah. Uh, really limit her yeah. ability to get in and do damage. The more people on fire, the better. And we're going to see Hammer just get cleared here. Yep. The smell and salt's there to move. Not an optimal smoke activation, in, in my opinion. No. I might, I, 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 I'm going to apologize now. I might be quite critical. Because well, smoke is smoke is your thing, smoke, right? Smoke's this my thing. It, it, it's it's what I've played so many games with her, and I feel like I know her so I, just inside out. Yeah, yeah. That with smelling salts on the table, you need to get as many people conditioned as possible because right now, Vet Cat doesn't have an option. Uh. Florian there, winning the roll-off for choice of initiative, turn two. So, Florian taking the, taking the first activation. Mm -hmm. I think we probably see more fire AoEs coming out early, essentially, yeah. to, re to move that ball on again to somewhere a little bit more protected. Yeah. Uh, maybe going to Naja to to stop uh, stop Hammer being able to get in. Yep. You're seeing a big stack go down on Hammer. No surprises there. No Superstar surprises. that he is. It, uh, it looks like three on Mercury for a fire blast and then a pass to Naja, and then probably dodge yourself back a little bit. I mean, yeah. Ha ha Hammer doesn't really as long as he doesn't get the knockdown, but he's got the momentum. Uh, on the counter charge from compound, he doesn't really care what, res what result is picked. No. Because no. he can't be pushed, he's stoic, so the double push doesn't matter, the single push doesn't matter. The knockdown, he just clears because he's walked in. And all that matters here is the crowd out. Florian just confirming all the threat ranges on Hammer and. Fraser very nicely pointing out that Vet Harmony isn't just there for uh, smelling salts, but is also there for mark target, yep. which obviously makes the threat range on Hammer right up to about 12 inches. 12 inches. Oh, going for the. Noxious Blast onto Hammer to get the momentum to then try the blind on Hammer. Yep. Good play. Makes sense. I like that one. That's probably a good place. I, I might put it to, to the extremity on the left-hand side so that you're forcing Brick and Decimate to go wide if they want to come through that yep. area. Right, bonus so time it's blind. successful bonus time with the blind. And he gets it and as well. And he hits well. it as well. So nice little play there. And still at your movement, so you retreat back a little bit. Yep. This is probably how, not too, is too dissimilar to how I expected this game to go for the Alchemist team, where they sit behind their goal line. Not their goal line, but their deployment yep. line. And they, they they really have to play the game like that. I mean, oh, they've yeah, got. You, I mean, the big puncher. I mean, this is. I think this is a big mistake that people make with Vet Cat. Is they're like, oh. he wants to punch stuff. I'm going to send him rampaging up the field Ooh. and like blah blah blah. He's a he's a counter punch piece. Yeah. I mean, in this situation, Florian is making making momentum with every AOE that goes yep. out and gets a hit, and he's and he's putting a fair chunk of them out, mm -hmm. which means he's going to be winning those races if he can keep everything at distance. And if if anyone does come in. Vet Cat is just going to eat them alive. Yeah, well, that, I think the, the only thing Vet Cat hates in this game is Tough Hide. Yeah. Because it, it knocks off his damage on his actual playbook and his character play. So his Momentus 4 that he usually gets becomes Momentus 2. Yeah. He'll struggle to take out to, uh, Hammer. Yep. And the other great thing about the way that the Florians line up here is 
the way that's the way that it's set up, if that cat is you know pretty much where that cat is, yeah. unless you come in from a real wide extremity, which you you're going to be unsupported. Yeah. Anything you send in, compound is going to go in, knock down, and set up the set that up. cat to just yeah, destroy. I mean, that, that that is always my favorite thing, where you knock somebody down with compound or with that cat himself in a previous turn. And they're like, hmm, I'm not suffering any conditions, don't need to remove anything. You're like, remember, knockdown's actually a condition. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yeah. Slamming. So seeing some really, I mean, it's KG play, but some really strong play here from Florian. Um, yep. Very defensive, but 100%. It's not, I mean, like we say, there's maybe been some little bit different uh, things to be done with smoke in that first activation. But, but pretty on, clinical on whole, and, it, pretty, yeah. and pretty standard for what you would expect yes, for yeah. this game to, and how this should play out. There could be some improvements on the AOE placement and what happened in turn one with the drifts and duplications, but other than that, everything's going perfectly. He's not overcommitted anybody. Yep. And Frazier, until Hammer gets in, which is the, the sort of thing that Hammer will get in eventually, he won't die before he gets there, that's when we'll probably see Frazier turn on the aggression. As soon as he gets in, gets some momentum, can start clearing conditions from his own guys. Yep. So we've just seen... Um Hammer take the extra movement and then yep. ball hog to go into Mercury. So this is going to so Mercury gets trigger. set on fire. In cover. Uh, Counter charge coming in here. Um, I mean, generally, what... Um, Do you reckon he was within five inches there? No, maybe not. Because there's, there's a thing where you are blind, so you, you took that to counteract that. Yeah. As, soon as, you get, you, as soon as you enter one inch, you get set on fire and you have to stop. So yeah, you'll still be engaging. That's fine. Yep. So, I mean, I they haven't put the token down, but obviously Hammer is currently poisoned and... Fire. Fire. Four. Fours and one. Using the SteamCon 2016 dice. Threes and one. Oh, it's, the, it's the counter attack. Yep. They've the got counter a charge. wrap here from Compound. Can't... Oh, no. It's all, all pushes get resolved into one, so... He's going to take the knockdown. Uh, the wrap does nothing. So... You yeah. So obviously, it's, it's, what Florian wanted here was the pushes, but obviously Stoic is. Stoic like just ignores pushes. everything on this one. So he takes the momentous two damage and knockdown. Well, three, but goes down to two. Yeah. Spends the momentum to to clear the yeah. knockdown, um, mm -hmm. which knockdown actually and then the clears the clears the All poison the and fire as well. Yeah. Momentous tackle knockdown. That great great result on two hits. Yep. Takes the momentous tackle knockdown. Then attack again. Looking for threes and one, get some Ooh, all. Big three hits there from Hammer. Uh, obviously, his tack been reduced by the crowd out from compound yep. and minus two from blind. And from cover, potentially. Oh, uh, it looks like it like looks just no, out of an inch. Mercury's yeah. not in there. Two damage and a push. Two yep. damage. Uh, well, yes. Has he taken Iron Fist as well then? No, he hasn't taken Iron Fist. Uh, he got three hits. He got for all hits, so he goes to the Two damage and the knockback. Yeah, the knockback, yeah, essentially is it. I don't know what he's doing there because the knockback has to be directly away. So Unless he has got Iron Fist and he's doing no, two damage I mean, push. They, they said at the beginning, you're not taking damage then, and he said yes. So oh, okay. Don't know. So that's Yeah, so th that was actually just a knockback that was not done directly away. Yeah. So... I don't... Oh. Oh, he just, he just nudged Mercury there. One more attack. Two hits this time. Doesn't take the damage that time. Strange. Just the momentum. Had the two push. hits. So it's really, if you've got two hits, you do one damage. You just, you just chip away, don't you, a little yeah. bit. Yeah, it's, it's the same result. But push, push and, damage. and then knock back. And then follows up directly towards. So he's cleared the ball path. Stays in melee with compound. Is he in range? It's blind? Blinded, so he's currently down to one six, um, but he's got he's got yeah. uh, ball hog up. Yep. But then removed one from thing, so he should be a two dice. Not uh, blind. Are uh, they forgetting blind here? Gets it. Could have made a difference. Only one success. Yeah, exactly. I mean, that should have been a two dice shot because uh, blind is obviously minus two, minus two kick. 
Yeah, but, so I mean, well, it scores. So that's Fraser on or Fraser, sorry, on four. No plot card come out there? All right, they're leaving the clock on Fraser there just because they switched it over for the counter charge. Uh, but uh, obviously yeah. forget to flip it back, so Fraser yeah. just letting his clock wind down a bit for the duration of that. Yep. Good, good sportsmanship play there. So a couple of, uh, couple of little things there that... Yeah, the knockback not being directly away. Blind being forgotten. I mean, blind such an important it was, one. I mean, blind yeah. was used. The thing it wasn't forgotten. It was used on the attack. attack. Yeah, and it was used obviously on the kick distance because he yeah. only had a kick of six. And the, and the move as well. And the move. But forgetting the but minus forgetting, one dice. Yeah, uh, minus two dice. Minus two dice. Apologies. Yeah. I mean, the bonus minus time two. is the only way that it got back up to two there. Yeah. So, yeah. I mean, maybe maybe it was not so efficient to take ball hog, uh, knowing you were going to be engaged. Yeah. Which meant which would have meant he would have had another influence somewhere on the board to do something yes. a little bit differently yeah. with. Not that I'm sure. I'm not really sure what uh, what Fraser can actually do from this position. Where I mean, the ball's now on compound. Still got Glutmas up. No one. No one's really getting into that. No. Seeing another fire AOE fire coming out. Grant. Can he hit both? Looks like he can. Yeah. It's good play there. Doesn't hit hammer. Doesn't hit hammer. And a tower. Yep. Does hit a tower. I just want to quickly check. I'm not sure that um, Fraser was on three momentum. So yeah. he, I think uh, he's, he's, he, he not knee slid, but uh, run the length back. Run with. the length back. Okay. Yep. I just wasn't sure if he managed to heal himself before he did that. But obviously he'd already no, done no. that, so wasn't able to. So wasn't able to. Florian um, popping some candy or pills there. Yeah. Proton, proton pills. Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> yeah. Bulking up like Bulking vet up cats like to vet get, cat, get, yeah. get in there. An interesting... Like, uh, as the smoke team, you, you, you generally accept the opponent's going to score a goal at some point. Yep. Like, and, and you just get you get possession of the ball back. And this team, well, not this team, the way this turn plays out, we spent so much influence already to get ball hog, to get uh, punishing march. They don't really have all that much left to do yep. this turn besides no. avoid. Yeah. And it, it's kind of like a reset of turn one where Smoke goes, all right, well, I'll play all these, posi all these out and Vet Harmony's now gone so she can do this with impunity now. Yeah, uh, and use Smelling Salts to clear things off, off Hammer. So yeah. you've got to think that's a, a bit of an early activation there by Fraser. Yeah. Um, knowing that he actually has the last activation this turn as well. So yeah. he, he could have just held her back. Yep, um, just sit there. Ha hammer on 14 health just being confirmed there. Yep, which is what I've written down, which yep. makes me happy. Yep. Some uh, keeping track of the health a little bit more diligently today. Yes. We are. <laughs> yeah. uh, we'll see, but you've got to think that we're going to see fire oh, and poison com compound. Compound making Th the pass to smoke nails it. Best footballer. This. I mean, I love. I love I scoring a goal with compound. It, it has it's to be my favourite thing. I think I nearly lost the game because I was so committed to it. He, 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 he came to charge down against Miss, took the ball and tackled, pushed away, and it's like. I'm in the middle of the pitch and I'm not activated yet. Well, I'll sprint seven inches forwards. Next turn, I was like, right. First activation. I've got first activation. I'll put four on compound so he can charge, <laughs> push someone away, buy another attack to get another momentum. And I was like, well, it'd be rude not to bonus time a shot on goal. Yeah, bang. Away you go. Finish the game. During that time, though, the, the union were just killing the rest of my team. But doesn't I was like, matter. it doesn't Moral matter. Victory. Compound's going to win me the game. Yep. I was like, I don't care, you've got one momentum. Your counter-attack <laughs> can trigger my gluttonous mass. It's all good. Yeah. All right, so we're seeing the, the vet cat yeah. brick moving just outside of that, uh, outside Makes of the threat and outside of the AOE. And putting in that six-inch brick stick. Yeah, yeah. I mean, is that a range? He's got good position. Needs to do something about marbles, because marbles is going to tick away and just die over time if exactly. not careful. He's got, Fraser's got to know that he's losing this momentum race um, yeah. pretty pretty swiftly, so... 
I mean, one of the interesting things that you can, you can do with Smoke, it was probably not so great against this team. But if, if someone's doing what they're doing against Vetcat here and just, just staying out of his control, uh, out of his uh, melee zone, uh, threat range, you can use Smoke and other members of your team to go and just jump ahead, charge them, push them in. Yep. And that way you get your additional. Florian, yeah. uh, sorry, just reading comments in uh, yeah. Twitch there. No, Florian actually just you know taking a bit of time here with this activation. I think there's going to be a smoke. Yeah, he's looking at how to place this smoke cloud and potentially do something. Um, it's do something score. Here. It looks like a, a rebound goal coming up. Yeah, and it's not it's not a bad time to do it. Like looking at the position of the board and the amount of influence that's around. Yeah. Smoke smoke can actually make a pretty good go of this. And but be in a very strong position to actually then take the initiative next turn and then and score again. Yes. It, it, it depends where the ball gets kicked out. I mean, if it goes central, you've got tower there with two. That's enough to go sprint, shot on goal. Decimate with one. She's not in range to do anything there. Yep. I mean, I, tower's, tower's on fire. It yeah. takes him down to being a, what, 3-6 three, six three, in six terms one. of sprint. Yeah. He's got the knockback ability, which people often forget about, and the amount yeah. of extra threat that gives you on a goal run is immense. Especially with the push on the mon. Yep. And a momentous push. I mean, just like reposition, get them out of the way, knock them back, go yeah. after them, and just yeah. really get the lines you need. But with two, I mean, the only person you can go into is compound, really. and, and that probably that just gets him killed. Yeah. Yeah. yeah he, well, not you, killed, but at least tackled. Or well, you, you allow that cat to have something to do. Yeah. Well, I, I, I don't think you need to go and um, score this goal right now either. Like you, you can, no. let, you can let the, you can let Fraser spend. I keep saying Fraser, Fraser, spend a bit more influence. Yeah, I would think moving Naja around, do it just, just to shuffle with Naja. Yeah. Or with, or with, co or with compounds. Yeah. Um, it looks like Naja there moves up. Yeah. Instead, it just, looks like we're seeing a legendary from Smoke here because okay. three points of condition damage. Yeah, just, just being gets declared. Through. Oh, so that was three damage to three Hammer. damage to Hammer, three damage Brings to him Tower, down to eleven, three damage and then to Tower, three Brings damage to Vet Harmony and Brick. So that puts Vet Harmony down to seven and Brick down to sixteen. So Florian declaring his intent there: one point to one point to sprint, yeah. one point to shot on goal, and one point to shuffle around. Yeah. <laughs> Right. Sets Moving hammer back on fire. Yep. Just give it a little wiggle. Little nudge. And he's going to sprint. So I'm assuming he's not engaged by anyone here and he's going to yeah. move over to engage the monkey. Yep. Yeah, Florian, they're just confirming. Just, uh, well, Fr Fraser asked, are you engaged? Fraser said, no. <laughs> no, I did not engage myself with Hammer or Vet Harmony. So, Fl Florian, they're using the ball as a proxy marker for Fraser smoke. just making sure that... Uh the base fits through the gap, and apparently it does. It does. Both players happy with it? Yep. Maybe not happy with it, but both agree to it. Yeah, uh, both agreeing that geometry is true. Yeah. Four dice down to three, so a juggling and attack. But slots the guess, goal in. Guess. Oh, goal, yeah. Knee slider. No, he's got knee slider five times, apparently, wow. from Florian. 20 he's inches of dodge. Completely yeah, stacked that deck. That, that is cheating, because he can only have three cards. I mean, he's taken all five. And he says, I enjoy where that is, where, where smoke is there, so. Yeah. That'll be a really interesting mechanic to see in the, in the four, future. Four uh, points of Florian. For, for a random captain, it's like the favor of Longshanks, and he yeah. essentially had to keep an extra uh, guild plot card yeah, or yeah. something. Yeah, that'd, that'd be, be, that'd be, be kind of cool, right? Yeah, yeah. What do we have if you get five bad ones, it's not great. Yeah, no, 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 that's <laughs> terrible. Well, if you get five bad ones, at least you have four bad ones. Yeah. I mean, and four they're, very and they're all, situational they're all cards. Situational, yeah. yeah. And, just, and just work with it. But 
It'd be an interesting little uh, character trait. Yeah. Or allows you to oh, replicate yeah. one. Oh. Double D slider. Whee. <laughs> return a discarded, yeah. to return a used uh, plot well, card to your hand. Well, it's something I've always thought would be cool is, is like an ability like that that would let you, let's say you don't like any of the cards in your hand. When you, uh, maybe like you, you can choose to discard one to shuffle the, the the other discards from the other opponents. Ah, yeah. And try and get a, get, a, get something from else from there. It feels like uh, we're mixing shadow games and guild ball yeah, at this point no. in time. <laughs> yes, probably, probably a, too much of a meta game in the plot phase of setup. I'm a of big, setup. Fan. Yeah. big fan. But that's, that's very much the sort of uh, Charles background. Charles Nurse, Charles Nurse, Charles Nurse. Upside, upside down, down cards. Do I have any slider? No, I still don't. I wish no, I did. Still don't. <laughs> Henry K still definitely has it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. So we just see the ball being kicked onto Hammer there to then make a four-inch dodge to to get away from Vet Cat. Yeah. Florian there, six, calling it Hammer Chicken Time. I mean, I don't think it's Hammer Chicken Time. I think he's going to go and try and, well, he can't beat up Smoke. Yeah, I think what we're going to see here now, probably Unless next turn, is it to passing it, getting in there, taking the uh, taking just, the Iron just, Fists, and just pummeling but, Smoke. Does he do her in one without tooled up? With four, no, probably not. Not with four, he, 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 he'll knock it down for sure. Yep. Looking at the old card, that's why that's why those results made no sense earlier. Oh yeah, that's that's, right. that's, that's the pre errata card. That's that would be we're why. idiots. We're we're good at this game. We're like yeah, tackle knockdown. That result's not even on his card. Don't we have don't we have a printed copy somewhere? Somewhere, yeah. Here, the we should hammer errata card. That. Should probably find one of those. Yeah, we'll get one of them. I mean, we knew the tackle knockdown was going to be taken, <laughs> yeah. even though it wasn't on the card in front of us. No. Nope. It's a <laughs> <laughs> Right, so we've got Tower and Marbles left to go. There's not a lot Tower can do here. I mean, defend those, cl uh, what is it? Defend the ground, pretty pretty useless. Tooled up yeah. at this point, irrelevant. Um, so the monkey just going in. Yeah. And what the monkey's trying to do here is pretty much... Make exact. it so, that the, so Smoke can't escape. I mean, you do this and you go, okay, well, I'll look predictable. Fraser's saying you can't go over a wall with a dodge. He's incorrect. You, yeah, you, you can. So, can. So, so long as you don't end, on top, end of it. on top of it. Well, you can end on top of it as long as you can stand on it. Yes. Uh, obviously, this wall, not easy. Uh, no, no. But... Uh, pausing. Yep. Fraser explaining he wants to box him in. He can't do it with one model. No. So play, players say just, just check in. Yeah. I mean, the players here, Florian saying that he can no, absolutely do it. He is correct. He is correct. Like, um, the, 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 these are things that you learn with unpredictable, where you can and can't go. You're like, yeah. I need to use this to my advantage. Yeah, so, so what Fraser needs to do here is actually set it up so that he needs to go around Marble's base and needs yeah. to wind up on top of the wall. Yes. But then if he moves too far around, he won't be able to box no. anything in. And, then, and you just say, oh, I won't take my unpredictable. Yep. So I think we're going to see... Because um, obviously, obviously Tower's going to try and come back and just generate some momentum, but you go, well, I just want unpredictable, yeah, and Tower comes in and I will escape. Yeah. But it's, it's whether or not... So what will be interesting here, Tower will go in and probably has to go into a position where, she, where he's behind Smoke. Yeah. So if Smoke is going to dodge anywhere, it's going to be forwards... Mm. Towards. Towards Hammer. Yeah. Which is not where Smoke wants not to scary. be. scary. But you're going first and you just... Cloud jumps out of there. Just, exactly. You're like, oh, bye. Yeah. You know what's amazing? Not being here. Yeah. Uh, I'll have my one influence effectively seven inch. Where'd they go? Yep. Six inches because he's on fire. I'm a bit curious. I mean, Florian, I don't know how many uh, momentum Florian's on, but I think it's a lot. Uh, that uh, dial on the on the far it, left it, there. It looks up, uh, looks like it's on a million. I don't um, know. Triggering unpredictable. Why you wouldn't clear fire if you're not winning the momentum race, I'm not sure. Yeah. Well, I think they might both be on one, to be honest. Oh, right. I'm reading the wrong like, end of the momentum I think, dial. I think, yeah. If, 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 if when Florian comes back from the table, you will we'll be able to see on that momentum tracker, it's, it's the big dial and it's the. There's a, there's a dark wooden end of it. Oh, right. Where, okay. where like, the pin is. I just thought it was where the peg is. 
Yes, yeah, so that, that, but that's, oh, that, and that's, that's zero. One. I thought zero. one was on the low oh, end. No, 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 and no. I was like, Florian has a million momentum. <laughs> Florian does take it on the dice roll, though. Yep. And uh, all condition the, damage. All the AoEs coming off. Yeah, so Marbles takes another three. He's down to two health Marbles left. Marbles got to be very low on health now, too. Two, two or two. three. Uh, Tower takes one for burning. Yep. I think poison and burning still on. Uh, I believe it's just poison because he missed. He rolled the one and the two on uh, hammer then he, there. Then he drifted it. Oh, very true. Very so true. Hammer takes three down to eight. Risky times. Uh, that's all the the conditions. But did, did Brick get himself? No, he, 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 got he, he, he got condition damage, no, but that doesn't, damage, that doesn't but do, didn't, didn't shuffle, didn't it, shuffle for the, it for the poison. For the poison. So hammer on eight. He's taking the damage slowly but surely. Yeah, I mean, but this is this, is, way, this is the way Smoke gets the takeouts, right? Is yeah. That just constant barrage of little two, bit, little one, bit, little two, bit. One. I don't Ignore care if you've it. got it's tough a, hides. It's, 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 it's just three damage. You can take that. You can take that. You can take that. His vet cat. Yeah, yeah. And I think we're finally going to see Vet Cat come in here. I mean, his Fraser's, his Fraser's got really got two choices. He either goes with Smoke and saves her, yeah, or goes with Vet Cat and chews up Decimate. Yeah, which Decimate's not suffering a condition, so the, the damage output isn't just isn't there. No, and I, I think you go with Smoke. I think you in, go with you go with Smoke. You, you save your smoke, captain, and you put the condition on Decimate and Brick to set it yeah. up. Well then, oh, Vet Cat within ten inches of Hammer here. But without and with but, with the conditions, so I mean, maybe yeah, we yeah. just see a so hammer take out. Uh, quite potentially, uh, eight health left. We can see a reliable nine non-momentous damage yeah. come through. Exactly. So we're seeing we're seeing uh, the vet cat position to try and engage brick to stop the counter charge. Yep. Uh, obviously, that's not ideal I'm for not, vet cat. I'm not sure he does go down with his tough hide. Vet cat needs to spike quite a bit to get it. He needs, he, needs, he needs to do well on his charge, basically. He yep. needs to hit the three damage on his charge. Yep. But getting uh, and getting rid of Hammer, though, if, it, if, if, if his dice pay off for him, this would be a this fantastic... This would be a big swing. I mean, it puts, if, it'll put him to 6-4 it and essentially would, removes five influence five from imp. the board. So we've got a nine so, dice charge. Uh, 12 down to 11. Down to 11. Looks decent. Big. Looks decent. Big. Two, four, six, eight, one. It is a wrap. That can do it. Nine hits. That's, um, that, that's three damage knocked down and then one damage on the wrap. Suffering a condition. Ignores the tough hide. That's four damage. Then he's got his momentous two on three hits for the remaining two attacks. This will. This could... All right, so Florian oh, saying you just forgot uh, forgot to take the damage down on Vetcat, oh, yeah, yeah. marking it off, and now choosing the results. Oh, that is, you've got to that think is, it's going to be four damage and knockdown. Yeah. So, players are just saying, I'm just going to read the numbers out because. Yeah. I mean, he hasn't declared a counter attack. Do you take the momentous three and intensify and just pulse and do the extra damage? Yeah. And yep, he, he chooses, chooses the momentous intensify. So we see uh, one, four, five. Five, five health points, left. Five points of damage. Yes, it is, yeah. So he's down to three left. Down to three left. Big, there, this big. is going to happen then. Fantastic yep. rolls, setting it all up there. That wrap really helping out. Choose us, witness me. Uh, no counter attack declared because of two, two inch, inch melee. melee. Yes, of, of course. course. Yeah. Threes and one. Threes and one. Another pretty solid roll there. Another four. I mean, I think you just go for the one and intensify. One intensify. So it's two points in damage. Two damage. Total. One health left on hammer. So that leaves and hammer on one, I think. Yeah, hammer's on one. At this no, it's three point. points. I think they've miscalculated the hit points there. Yeah, quite possibly. Uh, I think maybe they've got to take the damage for the three points of damage the, there on the, um, the intensify one. No, no, I don't think. I think from the conditions at the beginning of the turn. Oh, possibly, yeah. Uh, this still does it though. Six hits. He just does three points three. momentously. Down three to three. Push up to four, which down will to kill three. him. Takes him out. Gets takes him out anyway. Oh, oh, 
we forgot about passes the harmony passes. passes the damage on. Very nice. So takes the, witness me has been triggered and wasted. Yeah, well, um, it's still active for the rest of the turn. You can get it on yeah. a counter attack. That's it. Well, Vet Harmony takes four damage and intensifies, splashes back onto Hammer. By all rights, uh, it's, not, it's not intensify. It was three damage and the double push was the chosen <sighs> result. Interesting, interesting. All right, so, so they've uh, paused the clock here and called the judge over because they want to check how this rule interacts. Yeah. Um, just to make sure they get it right, which is, which is fair. Um, I think... I think maybe the, the condition damage was forgot at the beginning of turn I, I, here. Me, me too, which does... It doesn't kill him, because he's been, he's been saved by the Vet Harmony. Yeah. Oh, very nice. We forgot about that. That's what happens when you don't get a model that's not seen particularly yep. often. Ah, oh, that damage... Yes, it does. Uh, so the, the players there just called the judge over to clarify that... When Hammer takes damage, he gets Tough Hide, and then when it goes on to Vet Harmony, yep. is it the reduced or the actual? Yep, so... And I believe this has been clarified that you do get the Tough Hide benefit. Yeah, because it's when a friendly guild model suffers damage, this so, model may... So it, this, it suffers it after the modifier, yeah. and then gets passed, then gets passed so over. you get the benefit of Tough Hide there, yeah. uh, which, really, which really actually adds to the function of Vet Harmony. Oh, yeah, yeah. Only having 10 HP, obviously Vet Harmony, um, Season 2... Mm. Sister, left her sister and gone to follow Hammer. Yeah, making making that follow through and work yeah. really well with him makes a lot of sense. Yes. So she takes, she takes the reduced damage being confirmed by the judge. So that's yep. good. Three is up to the plus one, which is four. So it's, it's, it's plus or minus. So it's still three. And that and that leaves Vet Harmony on four. And I, I can't help but feel, if that turn one had seen more conditions spread out. That would the, be that these, we'd see these, a couple of takeouts. These intensifiers would be hurting her on on the splash damage, and then this wouldn't be available for it yep. wouldn't be a choice. So Florian obviously you know hasn't played a lot against Vet, Vet Harmony. No. Uh, asking asking how smelling salts works at yeah. the beginning of the game, so it was caught by surprise there uh, yeah. by the team player rule. Fantastic use, fantastic use. Really We're, really good. I think the other thing is, I mean, Fraser probably doesn't put Vet Harmony down often. You don't no. see her come down. So um, really good for Fraser to actually remember the rule uh, yeah. and catch this, and you know, force catch, the spend yeah. of momentum, force the essentially waste of witness me in yeah. the event that he doesn't have to do anything with well, it now. I, I think what we see now is the whole Mason's team turn around and you've got four on Decimate, that's eight damage. Yep. He deteriorates, takes four. Hammer can finish him off. Yeah. Brick can do some damage, get some momentum. Even Vet Harmony isn't bad at dealing damage to a 2-1 yep. model. So Fraser's saying he has to get the ball away because Smoke's there. Uh, really good point. I mean, yeah. Smoke's tackle is on two, and I mean, he's only tack four. He could the just safe place for the ball at this point in time is actually on Brick. Yeah. Um, so getting the ball in that sort of direction on Brick, there's no way that think, Smoke think, is going I, to I get think, that. I think, I think you just go score. You, you, you walk with Hammer into Vet Cat, punch him, say, Vet Cat, we're going to go score, pal. Yep. Let, exactly. let, let's, let's knock back all the way to the goal. Take the tackle, knock down with knock back. Yep. Then just start doing start the damage. Drag him, as Alex would say, get a big defense two model, hold him by the ear, say, let's go score, buddy. Yep. And at the very end, you push him away. Exactly. And I mean, Hammer would be going in and makes that attack at, at attack eight because crowded out by brick. Yeah. All right, so it didn't engage, didn't engage uh, Hammer so. with smoke there. So Hammer's actually in a free position to uh, go in and do that exact play. Hammer just scores. So you've got to think, he's probably going to take ball hog because he wants to be a bit safe kicking through these things. Yep. M movement and damage Taking from movement tower. Movement and damage. I mean, movement, where's he going to go? I'm not really I think sure. He, I, I think, I think we, could, we could see a six-point activation. Uh, Catalyst he's has taken 12 damage, is down to uh, 17. Right, so he's actually jogging around to the other side. So he's not going to be taking him for a ride. Well, he could... So he's, oh, he's he, going to go, he's he's gonna gonna go, go for the takeout. Yeah, fair enough. And I guess he passes to Decimate, and Decimate does it. No, not declaring a counterattack. Aware that the, the knockdown is the knockdown definitely is on coming. Two. It's yeah. pointless. And even saying it. So we've got an eight dice attack. Two, twos and one. Two, four, six... Fraser declaring Fraser he's got say, three new hammer cards yesterday uh, and left them other places, so doesn't know what yeah. he's got on so, this result. So he's had to pull his phone out. 
He's got three damage double push up to four if he wants it. Just oh, to guarantee. Also, I mean, you can almost just take if you don't want three the momentum. Three damage push. Yeah, three damage and a push. Yeah, so he's taking the momentous damage yeah. because of the extra there. So 17 uh, down to 14. Taking the push, getting the extra crowd outs here, and then doing and probably using not back to dodge back into base to base. Cool. Um, getting some extra dice here. Yeah. Florian just just confirming that he was outside of six with compound there. Yeah, I mean he's, he's missed opportunity if he hadn't yep. anyway. Oh, oh, that's a oh, it's a that hurts a little bit, but he's still going to take that momentous three, two and two and push, which is yep. up to three. That's it, and that push will will get the extra crowd out to down to eleven with knockback. So we've got another three attacks coming in from yeah. uh, Hammer here. Hey. Actually, no, I think he had to sprint to get there because he's on fire. Yes, yeah. So maybe only another attack after this one. Oh, no, he took Punishing March so he could jog so he could it. Jog That's in. fine. Yeah. I mean, to, if you want to kill him in this activation, you take one non-momentous result. Yep. Some... Not great results here from Fraser, but it's a wrap So That's one. a wrap, so he can do... He has 11, 11 health left. Five so damage to momentum. Seven damage coming off that cat there with Whoop. one momentum. So down to four health left. Yeah, so we've got another four get, hit points. Left. And now we, I think he's now going to pass the ball somewhere. Yeah, take oh, out. Oh, big roll. So we're seeing another four. wrap there. Two, four, six. Two, so two, two momentous results. So that takes out that cat, puts Fraser onto six. Yep. And then we see a ball hog pass to decimate. Exactly. Assuming, we're, we're assuming that. Yeah. It's not been declared yet. Fraser choosing. Right, taking ball hog off brick and passing it to Jasmine. Hadn't, yeah. hadn't taken ball hog yet. That's the right call. Gets the pass. Gets it. Momentous. Momentum for her to dodge, making sure she is well in range. Yep. And pretty Going. safe from over there as well. Uh, you don't need to worry about calculus as tackle. No, it's the Mercury tackle you need to be careful of because that's yeah. on one. Um, you can see that eight inches being measured out there, which yeah. is interesting because this thread is nine. So uh, I, I think it's, a, it's more the idea that if you want to come and get this ball, you have to come to the extremity of your eight yep. inches. And we see Hammer healing himself, obviously, you know, pretty damaged at the moment. Yeah, back up to... Uh, going back to five hit points. Five. All right, to going, seven. To, going to seven. I mean, if, if, if you want to go get the ball, you get countercharged by Brick. Yep, exactly. And Decimate from there, obviously, can just charge in, sit on the edge of the uh, sit on the edge of the inch, of the uh, edge of six and inches, then, and, and then, then do the dodge yes, thing to yeah. get through and score the goal to close the game out. Yeah. Um, well, not a hundred percent, but just about. Like, yeah, for all intents and purposes, I think what we um, what we potentially see here is Calculus go bonus time blind, just to try and get that kick. Reduce that movement, reduced attack, reduced. Yep, you, you can't go with um compound yet to put Rifa Corridor up because she doesn't care about it. No, I mean, she's you, got four influence, she's gonna go yeah. in and get it done anyway. Just charge in, take your double dodge. Yeah, you've got all the momentum in the world, you don't really mind about that. I'm um, I'm a little bit surprised that Naja hasn't played more of a role in this game, and not because I think um, the snake makes a huge amount of difference, but engaging people with Naja, given yes. the lack of two inch on the Masons team, yep. so if they need to try and get away, you can actually just put the po extra poison po condition out, free which poison. is very useful. Always um, useful. And then the other thing, like just having the ability to put hypnosis yeah, on you, key players. If, if, I mean, if, if you just put one influence on Naja, hypnosis, yeah. Right. The other, the other one that's quite interesting, like hypnosis on hammer, is a really interesting ability. Yeah. Because all those free abilities now then cost. essentially now cost one yeah. plus the one from another player. Yeah. So that makes it more difficult and makes hammer really inefficient. Really expensive to do what you want to do. Exactly. And, and the combination of hypnosis and blind, and oh, given that you've got yeah. unpredictable movement, hammers, no one's getting to you. No. Um, so I, I'm surprised that we haven't seen a little oh. bit of those sorts of things. We going see, on. we see the horrific code go up there from compound. Yep. But yeah. Like. Naja, just if you're thinking of killing the ball, you you hold it on Naja. With smoke, I, I the goal is tempting, but I always think you hold back. You hold like the goal is the finisher for me. 
you've got, oh, yeah, you've right, got exactly. such mobility yep. and you don't want to give the ball back to the opposition earlier than you need to because then they get to generate momentum and they get to clear the conditions. Yep. And you commit smoke when you, and she just ends up where she is now and you, you need to make suboptimal choices because you can't put your AOEs out which means you can't activate smoke and you're yep. sort of just delaying your exactly. smoke activation. Exactly. So I don't really know what the rest of Fraser's turn looks like here. I, it's... Um, we're going to see, I guess, a blind come down now. Hopefully the bonus time blind. Yep. That's, that's, that's the um, bonus time. Net. Bonus timing the blind. So 75% shot. Gets it. Gets it. But that doesn't really save Florian a lot here. I mean, Fraser can just retreat, essentially. Yeah, yeah you, you just go, okay, well, then I will sprint away. Yeah, and, and then Hammer's in a really strong place to get the takeout on one of on either one, of, of any them of next them. turn. And yeah. as, a la as a last activation we could just see Decimate pass the ball back to Hammer. Yeah. And then Hammer just takes a six-point activation at the top of the next turn because obviously yep. he's so high on, on momentum now. Yeah. And Florian's well, not five, generating five, any momentum from these AoEs because five two, Smoke's, so, smoke's away. So, far, so far away. Smoke is the linchpin for this team. One damage on Poison onto Hammer. Takes him back down to six. Uh, that was, that's where we've uh, tracked the health wrong on Hammer. He wasn't poisoned. Uh, so he was two points higher, which is why yeah. we thought he was on uh, one, when he was one on three. And not, instead of three. Yep. Yeah, and vet, vet Harmony being that sort of that additional health battery, saving any player that gets near death. Exactly. So useful. Although Marbles, as far as I'm aware, might die at the end of this turn if he's not already healed I and mean, cleared. Marbles was never going to add much to this game. No. Yeah, uh, they, they, the goad is irrelevant. Uh, yeah, the counter charge is I mean, with irrelevant. the placement on Smoke, who was the only person that was going to come forward. To leave the like, halfway line, yeah. Who cares? Yeah. Uh, it was essentially always going to be a free VP, which is why yeah. Fraser's not even bothering to put momentum into healing him. No. It's not adding anything. It's not going to lose him anything. He's going to come back. Yep. He's going to come back on a corner, probably over on the other side, where no one can touch him. Yeah. Tower's activated and advances up. Trying to pin smoke in here. Do you want to Florian the ball, taking the clock it over? because obviously if he uh, doesn't, he could get boxed in there by by Vet Harmony. By Vet Harmony. Um, not that it really matters. I mean, it's almost worth doing it to put Vet Harmony in a bit of an awkward position. Yeah. Uh, and not necessarily where away from Hammer. Yeah. I mean, what we're going to be careful of next turn is that Vet Cat returns and gets to jog onto that fast ground, gets to go the extra two inches finishing his jog on at the other side of it and then threatening the board 12 inches in. Tower spending two momentum there to heal uh, to heal Hammer, putting him back yep. up to 10 HP. Back up to 10. Nice and healthy Hammer. Over the halfway uh, healing point there. Yep. I think we see a smelling salts come out. Yeah. Clear those conditions. And then uh, the other thing I guess we haven't seen a lot of here is with Vet Harmony activating activating late is we're not seeing the, the breaking play. Breaking play, but I think with two, with two dice and a four plus, it's not going to save all no, that much. No, it's not going to it's not going to achieve a lot. And is it friendly or friendly guild? I assume friendly guild. Yeah, so it's not like you can even get decimate to fives to protect her from blind. Yeah, it's one of those. It's a very interesting play to have in a team with such low defense stats. Yeah. I think if, if it, you're, it, makes, if you, it makes a marginal difference. If everyone was yeah. fours and went to fives, fives you'd be like, be oh, this yeah, is yeah. a big, big difference. Uh, yeah. Just where you sit on that, that normal distribution curve yeah. of, of results. So, I think if you were playing against a guild like, say, the Morticians, where discounting Obulus, a lot of their other plays that are so punishing are on one dice. Like, yep. It forces them to use the momentum to bonus time because you're like, oh, I need to go back up to two dice. Exactly. Especially in a team like the Masons, where order of activation is, is so important. If you've got silence going, right, you activate now, you activate last. Yep. I mean, if Decimate wants to make this kick, she's currently a 1 4 to get the ball to hammer. Yeah. So it's not going to be easy. And she's going, heals herself, heals herself. Back to 8 uh, by my count. I believe so. She's back on eight. eight. Yes. Fraser and the players it. confirmed. Get it right. No infinite health dials this game. <laughs> no, but in, in game terms, they might as well be with Vet Harmony. Yeah, exactly. Uh, and, and using smelling salts to clear the conditions on Hammer. Yep. Uh, nothing unexpected there. 
and not even moving. Just like, you know what? I'm, I'm good, good here. I'm good here. Breaking play affected three of my players. I mean, there's a nice AOE ring there to hit all three. But, yeah, I would have you know, thought moving her back like half an inch would have been useful, but... It's other friendly, so she doesn't go to sixes herself. Yeah, that would that would be too good. Yeah. And just explaining breaking play now. Yep. Again, just another rule like, that you don't tend to see a lot of. Nope. Hits it. Gets. So hammers back down to nine and I'm um, burning. Chipping On away. Brick yep. hits him. So you've got, got to think that's going to happen. Fifteen and then fives, because doesn't matter anyway. Doesn't, doesn't get it. I, I think they played it as sixes there from the, what it sounded like, but it didn't make a difference. No, Fraser said it's her rule, so she doesn't get it. Oh, so okay, they're, cool. They're yeah, aware, yeah, yeah. But, uh, oh, flame jet flame coming jet. out. Here we go. Had the stack of four. Boom. Gets him. Two points of damage. Just goes it's up. Three, it's three normally. Yes. Again, not, not something you generally see. Flame jets are yeah. often Forgotten. maligned and not, not overly used. Yeah. Uh, but three damage in the burning condition. It's, it's nice it's for that nice. close range. Well, I think people have it in their head of the old season two and season one where it costs three. Yeah. And you're like, ah, it's too expensive. Exactly. For one extra damage, I'd rather yeah. hit more models at longer range. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Doesn't seem a doesn't seem like good value. Yeah. Unless, I, you've I, got, unless you've only got three, you need to do three damage. Yeah. I, mean. yeah. <laughs> I always felt so sorry for Stoker in season one and two, where he had burn the floor, and it counted as a terrain piece, and ground isn't terrain. Yeah. And it's like, oh, I guess I'll burn this wall that no yeah. one walks across because exactly. it's a wall. But I mean, Tower had the same thing with defend the ground, right? Yeah, like yeah, it yeah. was always so. The fact that those things have moved into the definitions. New things. Yeah. yeah. That's. I, I think. I think. But. but Back when I, when I was a Brewer player in season one, and they, they ruled that burn the ground only affected the walls. I was like, but, but, but now but, I can't use Stoker. But I can't use I can't use that play now because it doesn't do anything. All right, so we're seeing a, hey, a, bit of a activation. smoke activation here. Let's get everyone Rep replicating the fire and then moving uh, moving then. the original fire over to hit decimate. Yep, the decimate on fire and the poison onto Move those three. Yep. Boink. So that, that's going to put the poison nice uh, on all three. Let's smoke have one more. Uh, go on, put that fire on all three as well. The turn one play that should have been. I mean, it's only it's only two turns, right? And then we've got ha Vet Harmony with all the conditions. No, ha not Hammer ha with all the conditions. Brick with one of the conditions, and Decimate yeah. with all of the conditions. And a returning Vet Cat. And a returning Vet Cat on the flank. And so unless -wise, Fraser does, Fraser's still got four influence left. I think it, uh, yeah, so interesting one because we've, we've got two momentum on uh, Fraser's side and it looks like one for Florian. Yep. So we've got Decimate declaring a massive five inch sprint because we've got burning, burning and, 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 blind. Uh, and blind. Decimate's never been so slow. She doesn't know what she's doing anymore. No, it's, it's, it's just life's a very terrible place for Decimate right yeah, now. Yeah, just, just Dump that influence, put a second wind up, get somewhere safe. Yeah, for a one inch, one inch second wind, I mean, out of wow. breath. Yeah. <gasps> <laughs> second wind, not really. Uh, I, I don't understand why, it should have been two inches, but uh, we'll go for an inch. It's, it's yeah. less than the appropriate number, so that's yeah, okay. Yeah, doesn't matter. But if All he's right. worried about the charge. What an interesting... Interesting end of activation there from Smoke. That's what I like to see Smoke do, is stack them yep. out. So, Decimate takes the first point of damage down to 11. Uh, Vet Harmony takes three down to five. Ta uh, Hammer, if, if, we, if, we, if we're correct and he has both the conditions, then he's down to four, which is scary. Uh, plus one to Fraser. And, and it goes to Fraser. It. Do you want it? Yes. So, I mean, he because definitely wants it here, right? Yeah, I mean, otherwise you have Vetcat fly in, intensifies, kill Hammer, probably. Well, kills everyone. It kills everyone. Yeah, with that fast ground do being we, where it do is. Do we see? Do we see uh, an early Vet Harmony play here to clear all of that to pre essentially prevent it? Yeah. Um, like, th there's nothing else that can be done though, and the ball will. I mean, Decimate will still probably die. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's, that's the the worry is that the ball's there. Decimate dies. Uh, 
and then smoke and just uh, teleports over and slots say, another one away. And then it all depends on the scatter. Yep. If it's favourable, smoke can get that. <laughs> Look at this. Whoa. It's always scary. But yeah, like the, the AOE can hit all three of them, so the smelling salts can clear all three of them. And then you have that conundrum of, do I just sit there on that fast ground with that catalyst? Because he can threaten so far. Yep. And it, it, it's sort of that, do I launch him now, or do I get the conditions back into that trio? Because forced to hit, I still take those odds. Yeah, exactly. I think I think Fraser takes the first activation here. We'll probably see that cat come on and threaten that flank. Yeah. I think the, you probably just see Decimate with two or three. Yeah. Essentially, I think it's either one or three, sorry. Yeah. Um, the essentially allowing hit, allowing her to move up passable to hammer second wind and, and second wind herself and get further get, away just get away yeah because you you, you really want to see a six so. point activation here yeah uh, Fraser was measuring out there how far yeah, we got we've got the one on her yeah uh, how far vet cat could get and see if he could get to which get she to definitely hammer. definitely can yeah and so I think passing the ball you probably take the momentum and and go wide yeah, uh, forcing smoke to either have to jump or move to come after him to try and get the ball back. Yeah, which then means that cat's not activating. And if the the smoke activation fails on on doing that, I mean, smoke's not going to kill him. No, um, you can then push her away. Yeah, and then go into go into Mercury. Probably finish Mercury yeah, off. Mercury's uh, down to thirteen. I mean, it's not it's not an easy one. Um, mm. And I guess you still got the counter charge to worry about. Oh, you but say, you say worry, punishing, you, you, punishing march and everything else. Yeah, you, you, you get tackled is the only downside from the counter the counter charge now. Yeah. And then you have to try and push dodge into him, trigger his glut. You've had your stoic taken away, so it's probably not great. So we see the one on decimate there, two on brick. So you, I mean that's obviously the battery for that's hammer, just fueling hammer. Yeah. Uh, one on marbles, so that's either going to be a goad. Mm. Um, an attempt on a goad anyway, essentially yeah. to make Smoke's life difficult. Yeah, it means that she can't walk over to Hammer, tackle the ball and smoke. Yeah. So she'd have to use the smoke jump and then she can't actually get anywhere else to score. Yeah. We're looking at the uh, eight inches there from Hammer being laid out, but with Punish and March taking that to ten and the fast ground there, this could just be that cat pushed off again. Yeah. Which wouldn't be terrible because then your team is safe again. Super safe. I think got a little hammers, bit. hammers in a bad place, but you don't really care because you be you essentially yeah, go well up you, to eight, you and then wait, decimates in a position to basically win the game for you. Yeah. No, decimate going first. Okay, I think that's a going to walk up. Probably going to pass the ball to Hammer. Yeah. I like my idea. I like your idea. I think it's cool. I think this is more efficient, but I like your idea. Oh, I think <laughs> I think I think my idea. Get rid of that cat. You get none of this splash damage that's about to come out. Yep. Yeah, so, see the pass to Hammer coming. Mm. Oh, gets it. the last one gets it. He's going to make the dodge, dodge to make sure yeah. he gets away from Vet Cat here. Two flash played. Everyone, <laughs> every, everyone cries. You go, oh no. That was a brutal card. That was such a good card. I did like uh, using Don't Touch the Hair on when you had Hammer. So don't Touch yeah. the Hair. What hair? You're bold, man. <laughs> <laughs> it was also. Um, because two flash and one touch football were in the same thing, it's like yeah, so like, good. Oh, I've I've got two flash and you've probably got one touch football, so I'm you're scoring, but I'm benefiting. Yeah, yep. I'll have an eight influence activation with my captain. So Thank Hammer you just very retreating much. a bit there into cover. Yeah, he doesn't need to overcommit to score that goal. I mean, retreating to there unless the monkey moves wide, essentially makes go to relevant. So maybe yeah. now that's the battery for Hammer. Yeah. I think there's choices. Yeah, there's enough options. And this is this is the beautiful part of a Hammer team is yeah. you've got enough choices and the, this is the adaptability compared to Honor. Yeah. Um, you can, when when Vat Cat comes on the side, you're like, I think he's coming on there. Maybe he's coming on the other side. Yeah. Where do I need my influence to come I'll from? I'll just put some everywhere and, and everyone can do something with it. And if I take it, then they don't get it. Yeah. Whatever. Hammer gets to do his thing. Uh, we haven't actually done a time check, so I'm not sure. The game's been running for a little while. Yeah, well, so when, when, when Florian, when Florian uh, moves away, we'll be able to update away, you. We'll have a look at that. So 17 minutes for 15. Fraser and 15 for Florian. 
I mean, we're not really, we're, we're heading towards the pointy end, but with the scores as they stand, it's not, uh, and with all of the, with all of the damage as it's currently sitting across that Mason team. It takes, I mean, one, it takes one good Vetcat activation. Yeah, to and if Vetcat comes into Brick now, and um, has a good intensify. Splashes, splashes onto both. Yep, onto uh, Decimate, onto Decimate, Vet Harmony. Vet Harmony. Uh, we've got an AoE coming out here to, oh. to hit everyone again. More uh, poison. No, I think this is... Well, Hammer's yet to activate, so if you go in with Vetcat now, it just, it, it, Vetcat just dies again. Hammer's already, Hammer's already got poison. Yeah. So it's I'm still not sure. Poison. Uh, takes him down to three. Gets two points on tower. Two points on tower. And, ten. and gets harmony as well. Oh, three health left on harmony. No momentum for that team. Oh, Good blinded idea. hammer again. Bonus timing the uh, blind on hammer. Gets, gets it. it. Blind doing what it's meant to be doing, just this making everything. This is amazing everything. use of blind, like, yeah. honestly. This is, I mean, a lot of people don't really rate the ability, or they just think, oh, it's a one dice. I don't like um, it. But, yeah. I mean, you need to bonus time it, and when you yeah. do, it's so crippling. Oh, so yeah. So crippling. It means you've got to make some really clutch plays yeah. if you want things to come off. It means that you have to pass the ball. You have yeah. to get the extra movement back. You exactly. have to have gang ups to make your attacks worthwhile. Yeah. And that's why, I mean, I think uh, we'll, you'll see a lot of Union players include Hemlock in their 10. Yeah. And a lot of people oh, then sort of ask questions like, oh, but Hemlock, 10 health, not a lot of, like, defense is yeah. there, but it's not amazing. Like, playbook's not great. So having access to, uh, to Noxious Blast. Noxious Blast. Having access to, to Blind. And Smelling Salts is a bonus. And Smelling Salts is a bonus. Plus, she heals herself with Magic yeah. Brew. Um, she's an absolute toolbox. Yeah. There. And, that's, and that's what Hemlock brings to the table. Well, I, I, I always include her in my Union yeah. lineup because... Yep. Why um, wouldn't you? Because you, you go into you go into the the, uh, the brewers and you go right tap of your blind. Yep. Great. I, 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 Thanks. I, I, Thank I, you very I, much. I, I can I can live with that now. Yeah. Into these guys. Yep. Hammer. Huge. You're blind. Yeah. And with that rage, you have so much momentum available after your first activation yeah. with whoever. And if you can get it onto a striker, uh, it, yeah. it really yeah. limits their ability. It means they have to fight because yeah. they, they no longer they, they need have a to. dodge of some sort. Exactly. And that's I, and I think again like when when everyone bemoaned some of the changes to Harry the Hat yep. with the errata. He's, I mean, he, he, he still he drops goad. Molotov and has Goad yeah. and has an incredible counter-attack. And yep. that's that's what he was there for. Think, um, he was in, in, in one of my games at Gen Con, I had, I, I had missed kickoff at me. I was like, oh, you know what? Missed will score because of how far forward you've gone and you've ended up yep. in cover. I'm just going to go with Harry, put down the Molotov and goad you. And if it pays off, it pays off. And it did. And, and then the player was like, I can't score. Yep, I, exactly. I can't score. Go, I can't, and I Goad can't. and Molotov are amazing abilities, yeah. and, uh, and, and, and as is Blind. He didn't even really want to go and hit Hammer, uh, Harry, because he's like, if I make this mistake, you just get two momentum. So we see, oh. what do we see Hammer, there, Hammer, Hammer kicks the ball back to Decimate there on a one dice because of Blind. Oh. Dodging. Makes it. You've got to go into smoke, right? Oh, he yep. made the pass. Nice. Yeah, one dice pass out. Yeah. Clutchy, but whatever works. Hey, sometimes it pays off. Yep, takes takes Iron Fist from Marbles. Should Marbles not be dead? Or did he get healed? Get cleared? Must have done. Must, must have got. Must have. Must have cleared himself. Otherwise he's dead. Otherwise he minus one. Five dice into smoke. Fours and one. One, one hits. Hit. Two, Two momentous damage momentous there on damage. smoke. So smoke takes her first pip down to fourteen. Tackle knockdown, same amount of damage. And starts taking knockback. Just getting momentum here? Yeah, I mean, he, that's what he has to do. Yeah. Um, okay, one's cut there. All right, so that's it's it. three hit. So three momentous damage and a push. Damage down to nine. Last attack coming through. Oh, another three, three momentous, momentous damage. Six, nicely done. Some nice rolls there towards the end. Yeah. And uh, obviously s staying so he's engaging. Not the smoke cares. I mean, four momentum from... Uh, A blind captain, yeah. I yeah, and then he's spending one to heal himself. So, so he goes back up to seven. Hammer pretty safe where he is. I mean, you might see the, the flame jets and things come in, but 
Smoke's well, not going to do any damage there. No. Uh, but but now, now we've seen Hammer activate. Vet Cat is safe to go into the middle. Yep. I mean, there's what? One, two, three, four influence I can see there. Decimate's already activated this turn. Yep. I mean, so the, the, ball's ball's dead. Dead. the ball is dead. Unless Smoke goes after it, but I don't think that's a good play. No, you, you need two hits when you're measly tack four. She is yeah. not there for tackling the ball no. off people. I mean, so, Decimate's taken a bit of damage. Yeah, Decim Decimate's down to 11. Yep. You got, and with Intensify. I mean, it, 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 if you hit it, which you are on average is doing, you do kill her because it's four. She, she takes 12 damage directly and then you can splash. Yep. But I, I think from where, where, where you are here, you can go into Brick. Oh yeah, you definitely go hit Brick here. You go hit Brick and then your splash damage just kills Vet Harmony. Yeah, and, and, and probably does two. enough to, to put, you, put you in a good position to kill Decimate if you need to go and just Next do turn, the extra yeah. damage there. You, 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 take, you take two influence off the board, you yep. take Vet Harmony off the board, your conditions are fine, otherwise it costs Fraser a lot of momentum. Yep. And yeah, so I think, so I think he's going into Decimate. Because he said defense stance. Yep. Yeah, so he's going into Decimate. He's trying to kill Decimate here. Yeah. Uh, one hit. I, think he's I mean, that's a four. That's a four. Defensive stance would insinuate that yeah, this is one hit. Um, Interesting. A little bit awkward because it's sitting right there. Yeah. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Takes momentous push. No, shouldn't be. But shouldn't be. Should just be two damage. Two damage. That's not good. Two hits. Not killing her. I this mean, the crowd out from Brick's really hurting here. And yes, you should be, yeah. just be going for the intensifiers. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. Guess the intensifier on the last one. Too little, too late there. Four hits. Probably going to go for two damage and intensify to make yeah, it four. four. Knock down. Ball scatters. Ball scatters. I mean, it frees up. It frees up smoke. Freeze, freeze it's not, up it's, smoke it's actually now, quite yeah. a good call. Give it. Says, given he's he says, lost. He says just for the fun of it. But legitimate, uh, because otherwise the ball was sitting there and he had no way. No. I think he was going for the takeout to get the same effect. Yeah, then they're just as good. Yeah. And ball there, uh, scattering uh, perfectly for where smoke would want to end up. Getting a token for the knockdown there. Mm. Not a great vet cat of, uh, activation. No. no. Antithesis of goods. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's a bad one. Also just known as bad. And from from uh, Florian there, spending the momentum he generated to just maintain his health. Yep. Comes back on at 19. Yeah, just on a humble 19. Humble 19, yeah. I mean, so it's tower clearing his conditions. Sprint over, pick the ball up. Do you make the pass to get the harmony? ball? Oh no, into he's just going to go beat him up. Into base. Bind the. Down. Six dice coming in here. Yeah. Six base, plus two. And yep, counterattack declared. Might as well give it a go. Twos and ones. Big. Oh, there's the knockdown. Knockdown. Takes the. Uh, it's a, it's a non-momentous knockdown. Uh, yeah. Great. And I think now we see Brick just start to do some work here. Yeah, Brick finally actually getting to do what he wants to do. I mean, coming back I on with nine, uh, having to use the momentum to heal and stay at 19. Yeah. Brick's not going to do a lot of damage here. But well, it's, it's two more momentum. Yeah, exactly. I think we probably just see Vet Harmony go, drop Smelling Salts to clear everything from Brick, Decimate, and herself. I don't think you do that yet. That's got to be... Uh, who went first in this turn? It was the Masons, wasn't it? Yeah. I mean, you're not gonna, I mean, if she mo she drops it and then moves to engage Vet Cat to let Brick get on the wraps. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Maybe. Well, I'm just thinking the Smelling Salts... If, if she spends that two to do that, then you as the smoke player go, awesome, I have that AoE out, I've got Mercury left to go yet, I'm just going to reapply it to all of those characters. Yep. I think what you, you, I would do if I were in, the, um, in Fraser's shoes here is to jog round with 
jog or sprint round to go and get the engagement and buy an attack, get get weak point, take off that armor. Yeah, and then it's cool. just twos, extra dice because he's on the floor. No armor. Got three crowd outs. No, two crowd outs. I mean, you can just brick can just spend, uh, you know, from the momentous things there, just spend the two to stand decimate up and just get get to work on the wraps. Yeah. One uh, point on hammer one there. One point on hammer, just back chip down to six. chipping away. And flame jet hitting him as well, doing another two. two. So down to four. And gets momentum for both of them. Yep. And spends, spends two to heal. Spends two heels. to heal, smoke yeah. dropping him. It looks like back down to one on the momentum. Yep, smoke back up to 10 health. Game's been stuck at 6 4 for a while. Both players doing very well to negate each other's ability to score points. Yep. Brick able to jog two inches because he's on fire. Good old Brick. And uh, basically just going to sit. Get, get into base. Oh no, go into the extremity. Going to the extremity. And Brick's, Brick's got, what he's trying to do here is Brick's got knockback as well. I mean, again, yeah. often forgotten how good that counter charge is with knockback to just, just push you out of position. One damage, knockback. Yep. You're done. Um, so what he can do here is end, end it. Essentially pushing that cat with Away. the knockback, freeing up the counter charge. So if anyone yeah, comes up that flank, he's free again. Bringing it back. I don't think it's overly useful in that position, and especially uh, given all the activations that have gone, correct. it's just good play. Yes, yeah, it's a clean. The twos all hit, one off. So that's seven. That's a wrap. That will get him some momentum. Yep. I mean, a wrap of two. It's potentially like six mo six momentous damage. Yeah. So four damage. Four damage and two yeah, momentum. You want, Understandable, you, you want, you want to win, to he wants to win the first. race. Yep. Yeah. Because he needs to get that takeout and mm -hmm. and really force things here. Two ones, so five. Taking the two again. Momentous two. Another momentous two. Down to thirteen for that cat. I roll there's so many dice there because of the knockdown and the additional crown yeah. outs. Snake. Finally, the snake. Naja, go up to engage. I mean, I think I think he probably wins the roll off, uh, depending on what Smoke does. Yeah, oh, Smoke Smoke won't get to generate much momentum besides going killing the monkey. Exactly. Like, or, or trying to hit yep. two fives, uh, you know, on. It's not going to happen. You, you get half of your influence stack generating momentum on yep. average, just under. Monkey jogging. Probably just to get back in range of that counter charge, yeah. uh, and and or, or just retreat really. Yeah, Don't want him too close to anything. Yeah, he's cleared conditions. We can see that now. Yeah. So that explains why he's alive. The yeah. so smoke's last and vet harmony. We've got the the, the standoff. Yeah. <laughs> harmony left to go heal it and then. Yeah. So this is what we. This is what yep. Fraser just said. He's like, you're going to just reapply these conditions. So I'm just going to get some more momentum, and probably heal herself. You'd expect at the end of it. Yep, buying I mean, the attack. She's got momentous two on three. She's well doing this. Five dice. She's, she's good at attacking. People, people take uh, don't Five, see it happening. Five, six, seven, eight dice for this attack. Yes. Um, Miss. Six hits, which six, is a wrap. It's a wrap. Do two momentous and one, or two. Momentous two and a non-momentous one. Yeah. Oh, seven hits. So he's just, he's just generating Sorry, yeah, momentum. Yeah, just yep. Down to 11 with a dodge there. Seven again. So, same results though. So another two momentum. Down to nine. I think and he's got to spend one here to heal himself. Must do. Just going to listen in. He's got Florian's on zero. Uh, using come on, ah, mate. And he's we're got here the card. We And then spend one to heal himself. Okay, so... Interesting that he went to clear conditions there rather than actually healing himself. Well, it, well, if he uses come on mate on decimate and then uses field dressing, he gets to remove his own conditions as a benefit of come on mate. Yeah. And then he could spend an additional one to heal himself and take no damage. But th right. These oh, which is what he's done because he spent the two momentum. So well, the two was to hit... Oh, because he has decimate. to clear it on decimate. Yeah. But with an additional momentum spent there, he'd put himself back up to, by my count... 
back up to eight, uh, back up to seven health. Currently right. on but three. But he hasn't, he hasn't done it. And he hasn't healed it. He's not declared it. And I think as a smoke player, now that you've clicked the clock over, I mean, but I don't think the I don't think the fire makes it all the way there. Well, so you, you 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 duplicate it, drift it, and then drift it. Yeah, and he and, and th those three are just going to get poisoned and set on fire again. Yeah, and, and remember and th that three will actually kill that harmony. Yeah. Interesting. Might be a misplay from Fraser there. If we've got our, ma if, if 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 I have got my maths right. Yeah. Um, but what you, what you can do with these templates is because it's within, you can put your four-inch stick down and it goes onto the entire on the and it moves so far. I mean, yeah, having so that essentially far. like seven inches. Yeah, just from to, end to end to threaten somebody. And with the duplication, that goes up to ten inches. Nobody's really safe. No. On the on, on a regular match. Unless you're playing some jank where you're playing. So we see the copy of out. the fire coming out. Yeah, it, it makes sense. Going alongside it, pushing it. So like pushing it to the exact same place. So all those yep. players back on fire, back on so poison. Poison and fire on all of those players uh, now. Uh, maybe not brick. One one left. And a swing against the captain. And a swing against captain. So I, I think that's a mistake. Five dice is engaged by the snake. He's not going to declare the counterattack. I mean, if he gets some momentum here, it's irrelevant because he's still five up. Yeah. But I, th I think that the two momentum non momentous damage. So one goes down on hammer. So three on hammer. Yeah. And hammer is poisoned and on fire. So that's him dead as well. So I think we're going to see oh. vet harmony and hammer die in the maintenance phase. Yeah. I mean, so they come back on. They come back on. That's the. So hammer dies. That is two points for Florian. And we might and be wrong about vet. And then I th we'll just check, but I think that Harmony probably I think dies. That, I think that ha Alive okay, on one. So we, we, on we, missed, one. we missed something there, but. And one, Brick takes one. Tower takes three. Putting him on seven by my count. Right, so Hammer's got to come back on here, obviously. Oh, yeah, and just go. Uh, I think we just see him come in on the on the fast ground side. Yeah. Or just straight from, up the from, guts. From the back, I mean, you, you, you're pretty safe from there. And I think we just see Hammer go in and finish that cat off. Yeah. Doesn't need that he much to do he it. He doesn't even need a lot, exactly. He can jog Three. up, probably, to get in range. Three and steal one off someone. He gets four. Yeah. Four to guarantee it. And then... Mm. but But... How does um, how, how does Fraser, Fraser then can't close the game out this turn? I mean, not this turn. It means he's got to weather another turn of conditions. And yeah, people are getting real. So Vet Harmony down to one, Tower down to seven, Decimate on eleven. Oh, she would take three, so she's down to eight by my count. Yeah. Everyone getting and Vet Cat returning after this turn again. Six yep. there on smoke. Predictably, Hammer going first. Yeah. Grabs the movement from Decimate. To just walk in. To essentially just walk in. Uh, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Twelve because we're not down. Uh, yep, because... Nine health left. Decimate, obviously, has been Two stood up. Two and one. From the clearing conditions. Come on, mate. So... Minter's two twice, farming for the momentum. Five left. This is really good play from Fraser here, not oh, just taking just, not taking yeah. the um, I mean, Iron Fist, yeah. knowing he can get the damage done, yeah. basically making sure that he gets as much momentum as yeah. possible from this. I mean, he, he can start doing just like, if, if he really wants to eke it out, one damage, momentous push, one damage, momentous push, and momentous push twice there, which he called. So up to six momentum. One, one hit left. point left. Um, so we just see... Mentor's pushed twice. Really nice yeah, ability. Just eight momentum right there. And now he's going to do this, probably do something where he... Oh! oh, oh maybe not the wrap. Mentor's yeah, dead. Mementor's so dead. So it gets two. two. So it goes to ten momentum from five Ooh. influence. Very efficient. Yeah. Heal Harmony. Heals Harmony for four. So she's back up to five. That puts Fraser up to eight points. Yep. Is a goal in his sights? Don't think so. How's Harmony? She sprints eight, kicks six, not enough. Maybe a legendary to get ball hog on someone. I would have thought more punishing March. I mean, having oh, oh, having yeah, Tower it, it, being it, able it, to get the extra movement. One or the other, isn't it? I mean, yeah, you Hammer. take you take one. You take you get to choose at the beginning of your activation. 
Um, when each of the friendly guild models starts its activation within the Sora, choose either plus two or one damage. The other friendly guild model gains the chosen benefit for the remainder of the turn. Yeah, so... It, it, yeah, so it, it, Bull, Bullhog doesn't increase your distance. So yeah, you, you take punishing march, don't you? Yeah, because he, he might make it to Calculus then if to you just get that Harmony. Weapon. Take the couple of knockbacks. I don't know how much influence is on Tower, but if he's got the four... Then yeah. Then yeah, you, you're going to... Mm. Essentially, you can charge in... But, I mean, you've still got that counter, counter charge. And this yeah. is something that Fraser's... He's actually done pretty well in terms of... And this is what we were saying earlier. Yep. He's done well in terms of getting Vet Cat to advance up the pitch yep. and be isolated. If, I mean, if when Vet Cat came back on, he'd gone back and gone a bit back... deeper and behind that. deep and behind and just start the gun line going again, yep. maybe we'd see a very different thing here where Fraser would have to be overcommitted and Vet Cat could just pick on one pick player on one at a time yeah. rather than getting crowded out and swarmed like that to yeah. allow 10 momentum, 10 momentum from 5 from, influence, yeah. which is just huge. I think, I think that fast ground is too enticing as a Vet Cat player to go, oh, I, if I get that, I can threaten from 12 inches away and yeah. I can pr probably kill someone. And when the dice don't come off like that, this is what happens. You just lose him and you give so much momentum to your opponent. Exactly. I think it's too enticing for most players, if I'm totally honest. Oh, I mean, everyone, sure, everyone sees, everyone oh, I can walk move. on, get the plus two move, and now I can charge into the middle of the pitch. It's like, yeah. that's not where you want to be. No, yeah. no, no. <laughs> Come back on with half your health. I mean, you're just, just lining yourself up to kill. Get killed by a captain again. Right, so breaking play. Vet Harmony is activated early this time. Yep. Blind, Blind. going on tower there. Yep, oh, nice. On, done. Was it on tower? Yeah, it must be. Yep. Yeah, it's on tower. There's no, other, there's no other real good target. No. Nicely done. Seeing Before a move over the poison. wall. Just walking, which is, that's, which is legal. That's interesting, because now, I mean, Tower Tower can pretty much just drop the ball on Decimate. Yeah, but I don't think Decimate's, got, Decimate's only got two, right? Yeah. And this is, and, I mean, well, having I think, and, and maybe ta and taken one off uh, Decimate as well to get Tower to be able to yeah. do things. Threes. Brick and play. So that's one damage onto... Brick. Brick, down to 13. Fours gets tower for another two. Gets tower for another two, down to five. And momentum generated. Yep. I mean, I. Heals yep, himself. So, I he's, mean, got, he's got all the momentum. Fraser just going, this like, now, oh, you right. can do whatever you want to generate momentum from there. I'm still going to win this race. Yeah, yeah. Let's think of. One die kick to. Uh, That's Just gets like. It. Whatever. Don't care. Don't, I've 50, got 50 momentum. Odds. I'm not even going to bonus time it. Yep. Keeping the momentum. Oh, I think a four-inch dodge forwards there. Would have been really nice. To get the sprint. Oh. Just walks to the side. Is already poisoned, so... Yeah, it doesn't matter. Getting back into the habit I think of we're seeing him stay within three, but i do not not really sure uh, why. Out, out of three. Out of three. Yeah. See... He's got four on him. Flame Jet. Flame Jet on tower. Hits Getting him. him. So down, Three points of damage. Down, down to, to two. Six. Oh, down to six. He's after, healed himself. After, yep. after the heal. Fire AoE. Go on, you want to try and hit two if possible. So he's out. Two. I mean, he positioned tower such that no one else was in there. Yeah. I mean, Florian trying to set the ball on fire. Yeah. What, what a rule that would be. Really nice positioning there to force, uh, force Decimate back into Gets the poison it. or the fire. Down that kills health. him. No, they've taken him off, so... Oh. Okay, yeah, that's, that's a death. So Florian on eight. So they must, he must have uh, cleared conditions from that heal Possibly, with tower yeah, rather than uh, the taking the... Yeah, taking the four health. So this makes it quite no, interesting. That, that's, that's, that's correct, yes. yes. It, 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 he went up to seven. I, I've missed a marker on mine. Ah, oh, right. There we go. Yeah, he went to seven, took the flame jet three, and two AOEs as four, which is yep. death. Yeah. So this this puts this puts things in an interesting sort of place. I mean, does I, is, I don't know if there's one or two on decimate. If there's two on decimate, I, I think, think I probably Seca wins herself and, and gets, goes for twelve deep. inches and goes really deep to allow. Well, you, it just forces smoke to have to go the other way and be a pain. Any on compound? One? No, it doesn't look like there's any. I, I, I think he's got one. I think you, you always. Always put one there, just one for horrific odor. Yeah, yeah. Interesting game. One very goal in it. Very interesting game. Very Play close. And like we said at the beginning, I mean, both these players very good. So it's a bit of a, you know, we're, not, we're knocking uh, 
either one of these players really were in a position to go on and be when, a threat at the final. Yeah. Uh, so whatever think, happens, this is, this is a bit brutal. I think we're iron up. Yeah. Iron up a... Uh, a smoke goal run there with goal. Decimate, which is... It's a, cra it is a crazy idea. But Dicey, but go for it. Because if, if, it, if it comes off... It comes off. I mean, it's looking at it, it's what? It's a two dice, two dice shot on goal. Yeah. Bonus time it, and you're, good to, you're away. Yeah. I mean, the, the trouble is getting the ball. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. But, I mean, he's got enough momentum. I mean, you just bonus time everything. Yeah. I mean, the, 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 the worry is the counterattack as well. Of course. I mean, especially with all those crowd outs. I mean, you've got to think these good. I mean, the counterattack could be a tackle double dodge. Yeah. And that, that's a bigger problem. Exactly. Or even, even just the tackle. I mean, you hitting your tackle on um, smoke is, is a, a big ask. I guess the 4-1. I mean, you've got... You tackle on two. Tackle on two. Yeah, four you, you, one. You bonus time it. Oh uh, yeah, but you're crowded out by two as well. So I mean, you've got three dice. You've got yeah. to get three four pluses. No, not not fun. Well, I mean, it's fun if it happens. Oh yeah, it's it's just just not I, I think you'd be crowded out by one. Just yeah, marbles. going to there. But I don't know how he gets there. Uh, you smoke jump and walk. Yeah, but I mean, he's too far away to smoke jump from there. Nah. Or walk as well. He's got to walk in the smoke jump. But he can't get out of. Yeah, so yeah he's got to be touching the fire AOE. Yeah. So he's going to the poison AOE. Drift the poison Drifting AOE it, in. Then nah. jump to it. Here we go. No, right. I, don't, I don't think he is going for it. I think he's just going to no, kill gonna, him. I think, I think this is the right thing. I mean, Harming's yeah. on a really low health total. Marbles is on a really low health total. Yeah. Clock's got to be super low now. Yeah, and if Florian's looking at the clock, he's going, you can't score this turn. Yeah. And if I can get the takeout on Marbles and Harmony, I go to 11, and then the yeah. clock does that. Yeah. So we've got a minute left for Florian, and four, just under five minutes there for Fraser. So Fraser playing the tighter game. Yep. Still looking at the smoke, smoke jump and a few little taps to bring Decimate down to dangerous levels, maybe. I've got to be careful with that, though, because obviously, I mean, giving... All right, we see the attack on Decimate coming. Yep. <laughs> Decimate. Taking it Anything. all the way around into base. Yep. Will counter. Countering. Four dice, four and one. Bonus time, Bonus it's time up to coming. five. five. Boom! Oh, gets the tackle if he wants it. Or is it. Choices. Taking the tackle Take the anyway. Tackle. 100% the right thing. Oh, there oh, you go. Tackle, ta double, dodge ta time. Tackle, double, dodge. Boom. Tackle, double, dodge. Ending Smoke's activation, ah. really. I mean, there's not a lot else because he's moved both of them already. He can yeah, duplicate but he, he them. Just but du duplicate and drift. Outside, outside of an, outside an inch, inch, yeah, of course. Yep. Outside of the inch. Which basically means Decimate now can put second wind up and sprint away. Yeah. Copying the fire away and setting setting uh, hammer on hammer fire. Hammer back on fire. Decimate left. I think we just see him. Clear conditions. Jog six. Second wind six. And well, then I, try and... I think I think only got two influence because hammer stole that third one. So I think a uh, okay. second well, wind just, just sprint. Six, uh, clear. Well, he's got two. Oh, sprint. Okay. I don't know what he does with the last one then. I mean, and obviously, second win gets you further three inches. Sprint, pass back to Brick, take the four inch dodge to get snapshot range. Brick makes the bigger boy pass and snapshot. I mean, I'd, I'd rather pass it to Hammer. But Brick's not yet to activate. Has he got any influence? No. Ah. Oh. <laughs> oh. I mean, that would be. That would be remarkable. I would love oh, to see that's, oh, what is that this? as this isn't a play. what I want to see. I want uh, to see decimate. that play happen. Fraser uh. going to kill the ball here. So he's now, looks like Fraser's playing for clock. Yeah, um, yeah well, he, he's got the option to. Well, I mean, I'm not sure he does, just based on the amount of damage he's going to take. Unless, he, unless, you know, next turn he looks at it and thinks, that cat can't get to me, that's a lie, because where Decimate is will get him killed. Yeah. Right, so we see that. The clock's, clock's pretty low. Um... With a play like that, I've got to think Fraser's playing for clock. Yeah. So Fraser's probably going to win this roll. Yeah, there's nine seconds left on Florian's clock. Fraser wins. Um, very little time left on Florian. So we're about so, to see all the damage come off. Yeah. Three on Decimate. Two on Hammer. 
One on Hammer, one sorry, on Hammer. just burning. Monkey dies. Monkey dies. Gaining one point Florian for goes Florian. Up to nine. Harmony takes three. Still got a lot left there, apparently. So uh, two, but by my account, it was two left on Vet Harmony. No, there's a lot more than that, looking at it. She was not she on, was nine. on nine. She was not on nine. She was not on nine. Uh, She's gone from seven to four to eight to five to three. So nine doesn't make sense, but okay. So that changes things a little bit. So obviously oh, yeah, now Fraser, yeah, Fraser, Fraser can just Fraser just now plays clock. Yeah, so I mean, our, our commentary there, based off different information, makes a lot, a lot yep. more difference. Uh, guys in chat saying that the uh, two-inch dodge from decimate around uh, was right. very very far yep. to get outside of one inch of smoke on the other end, and potentially yes, but if both players are happy with that then that's what you were uh, you need the, the frozen forge widgets to be super super clear about everything yep so I think I mean given where the clock's at and the, the sort of clock out state we think that Fraser just runs into the back corner here turtles turtles up under the under the beautiful uh, counter charge bubble of the brick marble scenario to keep yeah. smoke at bay Florian will clock out this turn and essentially just hand Fraser, uh, Fraser, oh, Fraser, I'm copying Fraser, you yeah. now. Uh, Fraser four points for this win. Yep. Let me see if has Vetcat come back on. He's come back on deep, just can't can't afford to. Uh, <laughs> I, th I think he's probably going to come on wide. We hear the clock ticking down now. Yeah. Um. So the first activation will be on on a minute activation and will. No, I think he's end. still got three seconds left, so I think we'll uh, be a minute and three unless he can yeah. do some pretty janky, uh, very quick... River Coda. Yeah. Snake. Just to, just to make sure he doesn't give up too many points immediately. Yeah. Also, he doesn't lose his turn. Yep. So we see Decimate just running to the back corner. More than uh, and there's Clock out. Yep. yep. So we see the see Clock just, t just ticks off there, so that gives one point to Fraser. At the end of this activation. We'll go to nine at the end of this activation. Yeah. So we see a snake going, buying an attack, needing fives on this with not a lot of dice. Doesn't get it. Doesn't so get it. So Fraser it goes to nine. to nine. Fraser should really now just play some really quick activations and, and force just, just some force safety. Some, yeah. Uh, I mean, like, and basically now no just one's going to die click it just, just clock himself just out just click it yeah. that's, he's just, that's all he's done sprint back moves click, up sprint back gaining click, another point at the click. end of this yeah. seeing a hit to do a point of damage on I don't even know what's happened he, I mean he's not put no Florian says I can't win this but I'll just play yeah, it I'll play I mean, it out it's, it's interesting to see because I mean obviously Something I don't know what happened with uh, Harmony's health there, but both players seem to yeah. agree that that's what it is. Yeah. Well, um, I think Florian seemed a little bit shocked that it was so much as well. I, th I think there might have been some condition damage missed. Yeah. Which is why whenever I play Smoke in the maintenance phase, I'm like, let's pause the clock. And just assign everything. And let's do everything. Yeah, like exactly. I've, 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 got, I've probably got conditions that need taken. Let's just do it all, make sure yep. everything's above board, and then we carry on. Exactly. Just because it's so, Tater Syndrome. Yeah, yeah. I think it's something that... Um, Players need to be really mindful of because obviously, I mean, when we're when we're talking about events like this, where we where there's, you know, we, yeah, yeah, yesterday the last chance qualifies with big yeah, prizes big, on big, the line, big big, big thing. little things like that actually have massive massive impacts in yeah, the game. That, well, they, they change what you're able to do because let's yeah. say let's say someone was on four health, smoke's not great attacking, but that you, you can do that. Yep. If someone's on six health, she exactly. can do it, but it's not reliable. Yeah. Yeah, and when you look at Fraser on 47 seconds here, I mean, he, if he was down on 11, if, he, if, if, if Florian if, was on 11 now, yeah. that, that 47 seconds becomes really important uh, yeah. to, to make sure things are going. So, yeah. it's not... And I that don't takes think out Vet Harmony, so back up, to, up to 11. It's Fraser's like, both on 11 each. now. Unless, unless, unless Fraser, I mean, Fraser, Fraser, Fraser really should just walk just, away just and just click. clock. Just click. Like, it's irrelevant. Yeah. Um... Yeah, just 11, 11, over yeah, there. Does yeah. that. So unless... Yep, yeah, and that's it. And Florian, that's game. Florian hands it over. Fraser so. gets up to 12 with a, a clock out from Fraser there.
and that is the game. Yeah, so again, I mean, I think we I need mean, to be really careful as players yes, um, yeah, I on, mean, if, on if, condition if, damage and on, on those things and making sure it's very clear. I mean, the, ma making sure your opponent's aware that you've healed and that, you, like, just a, a good, clean play thing to say, I've healed them on seven. Exactly. I've healed them on nine. I'm, I've healed them on this. And it, it, it just makes it clear to your opponents because if, if your cards are away from you, they can't be seen clearly. And when someone does ask, what's your, what you, what's your damage? You click, click the clock on, give it to them. And yeah. just make sure everyone stays aware. Of exactly, exactly. And I'm, I mean, obviously, we're not insinuating anyone's doing anything oh, below uh, board here. It's, 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 it's a stress and time pressure thing. Yeah. But I think the, the importance of clean play, especially yeah. in the larger events, is so needs to be stressed. And it, it's one of the things, uh, as somebody watching, as somebody playing, and it's what I I'm, I'm personally try to be very mindful of, mm. is I, <laughs> frequently in the game, Let's say if I've got 10 minutes left, they've got 15 minutes left. I say, right, we pause the, pause the clock and let's clear the table because usually everything starts to move in. And like, the board's getting super messy. It looks like we're playing in a 2v2 square at the yeah, moment. Like our game yes. last night. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> 13 players in a big scrum. <laughs> yep. <Yeah>. Ridiculous. <laughs> but it, it, it's just, let's, let's take a second, playing a game here. Pause clocks, sort everything out. Make sure everything's aware. And we're happy now. Yeah, good. Like, let's roll and carry on. Yeah, exactly. Uh, I mean, I think I think we're all guilty of it when it comes for to sure, those, those sure. the dying seconds. And you're like just throwing dice. You're just, you're just, and you're just like mumbling words and yeah. throwing tokens in the direction of things. General things like, right, he's knocked down and he takes two damage. And, and, yeah. and, 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 and it's, it's on like you. And you're like, what the dice hell in just hand. happened you're just like, <laughs> dead and dead. Good. Did clock. What just happened? Those yeah. two models are gone. But but you're now wasting your opponent's clock. It's, yeah, uh, yeah, it's yeah, a little yeah. bit awkward. It's, <laughs> it's like pause. All right, what I did was. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But then it's not on your clock and it should be because you explain and it just becomes a little bit. Yeah. So just just be con be conscious, players, of your presentation of the game. Exactly. All right. We will catch you later on today for round two of the British Championship qualifier. And if you are available to do so, be sure to join us tonight for the keynote speech should be very interesting. We'll see you all very soon. See you then.